statement and then uh, for some questions. Yeah, wow. I mean, uh, I was telling our team in the locker room right now, we've, we've now rattled off four straight wins against teams that uh, each have um, 20 wins at least on the season. And we've done it because we've just started to defend at a ridiculously high rate. And, uh, you know, tonight was a great example. Uh, they are a great team who's having a great year, and we just simply dismantled them offensively. We have done that now for several several nights in a row. I thought something that really, two things helped us, I think, tonight. Um, one, uh, this was, I, I got my math right, I think this was our 13th game this year against a team that played in the NCAA tournament this year. I think it was their second, um, including last night and tonight. We, we've simply played a schedule that, that prepares us for this type of opponent, and I thought that showed a little bit tonight. That's one. Two, I thought last night was such an emotional win for them. To win in this place, uh, it doesn't happen very often, and against Hope, and so I thought I thought we had a little bit of an emotional edge tonight. Yeah, that second half, coach. I mean, they started, you know, they were like one for twelve or <laughs> something like that, and you guys went on that seventeen-two run. Did you make any adjustment at halftime at all? I should probably say I did. Um, no, I didn't make any halftime adjustment. Uh, I thought I thought both teams at halftime were really fatigued, um, and we made a couple plays early that kind of energized us. I thought they looked tired. Um, and candidly, I thought we did at times. Um, and I just rode that, that first five. They, they were playing so well. And so I kind of extended them a little bit and was a little bit worried about Nate and some other guys. But um, I felt like we had a chance to get the, the, the lead big enough that we might be able to win the game right there. And so I let them, let them go. And I thought Nate was sensational. His defensive effort tonight was pretty special. Yeah, and then you also had a good two-handed dunk in the lane there. You know, for that on offense, you know, you guys are clicking in that second. Can you talk about just – what was going well for you guys in the beginning of that second? Yeah, well, the great thing about our team is having Tyler Peters. You know, he draws a lot of attention. And uh, from the start of the game, they were doubling him in the post. So uh, he was kicking around. We were getting good open shots for that. And, I mean, the time when he drives the baseline, that's been a pretty common occurrence during the season where I just kind of go to the middle of the lane. He does a great job finding me there. Um, so that's always fun to get it done. It kind of gets the team going as well. Yeah, Coach, tell me about Braden tonight. Uh, he was a big spark in that run as well with two threes. Tell me about his name. Yeah, he was good all weekend, wasn't he? I mean, he, he had a stretch last night that was pretty special uh, that carried us offensively for a while. He is just such a gifted offensive player. Really hard to guard. He's a unique player because he can make those perimeter shots. Um, but what he does best is, is penetrate one or two dribbles, get contact, and then rise up and hit pull-up jumpers. So he's a really tough matchup. I thought, though, some of his looks were the result of, of us sharing the ball. I was really pleased. The first half, we were over penetrate, we just dribbled the ball too much, and they have such uh, great defensive uh, quickness uh, on the perimeter. So we just really encouraged him to move the ball. So I thought uh, some of his threes were the result of us just sharing the basketball. So I thought that I was really pleased with that. Yeah. Nate, 10 rebounds tonight. Uh, you know, can you talk about just your overall game, double double tonight? Um, can you just talk about your efforts on the board, what you did on defense, too. Uh, rebounds are something I uh, take pride in. Just takes hard work, and um, you know I I think I'm the kind of guy that I prefer to get more rebounds and points. Uh, and I think uh, I need like five to pass the next guy on the list for the. So Is that right? I'm serious to keep track of that. I'm I'm <laughs> yeah. yeah. So I mean I'm, I'm just trying to you know it's a huge thing for our team. Uh, you know we really get those passing lanes, disrupt them, and you know we can limit them to one shot. That's you know it's great for us.